안녕하세요. 제 이름은 나미입니다. Hi, it's Nami. It's been a week since I have colored my hair blue, but I want to see how it washes out because I haven't washed it yet since I've colored it. So this is going to be the first wash after coloring. Let's take a look. This is how the pastel blue from Overtone looks. On my platinum hair, this is how the pastel aqua looks. And then right in between, you can see the Colorista blue. I really like this shade. I kind of don't want it to fade. But let's take a look and see how it washes. First of all, how it fades and how it dries. Oh, it's so cool. Hello. It's me. Before shampooing, you can already see a little bit of bubbling from my leave-in products. But there's not much color. I'm gonna use my Marc Anthony shampoo and conditioner. They are sulfate free. Oh, there's a little bit of blue coming out now. Please take a look. I think that's from my colorista. Because if it was from my whole head of hair, I think it would all be blue. Hmm. It could actually be coming from the whole head because I see different tones of blue just like how I put different tones of blue in my hair it's really pretty normally to keep the vibrancy of this blue I want to use my overtone daily conditioners in pastel blue and pastel teal in their respective locations to keep the color going but because I want to see how this fades in terms of the pastel blue the pastel teal and also the colorista that I put in my hair I am going to actually just use regular conditioner, like non-colored conditioner, and apply this before my whole body and face <laughs> melts from this dripping water. This is how my rinsed water looks after shampoo. I'm going to drain it and see how it looks after conditioner. By the way, if you're not sure what shampoo and conditioners are really good, I really like the Marc Anthony brand. They have a lot of products that are sulfate free and sulfate really dries out your hair in um, shampoo and conditioner so I would highly recommend, I'll leave a link below. Conditioner water has the tiniest tinge of blue but it really looks mostly clear. My hair is now dry so let's check it out. The colorista actually doesn't look like it faded too much. The rest of my hair, I don't know why my top of my head looks a little bit more purple, doesn't it? It looks more silverish in person, but on the camera it looks more purple. The back is probably like split open, isn't it? Oh my goodness. So this is what it looks like to the top of my head's color. Definitely looks a tad bit more silverish, but you can see the color still, the blue. The colorista hasn't faded much actually. Neither has the overtone, but the overtone does look like it's a little bit more platinum than it was before. Let's go over to the window. We can see a little bit of sunlight comparison. That's the colorista right here. It still looks quite blue. The top looks a little bit more grayish or like silverish with a tinge of blue and maybe a little bit of lavender. The teal looks more blue than teal. The colorista doesn't look as green as I kind of thought it would. It's still pretty, I like it. Today's feature comment is from Chu Chai. You should really use gloves. Thank you for your comment, Chu Chai. I should. I really should. I should. Someone needs to send me gloves. Someone send me gloves to our PO box, please. I always use like kitchen Korean like food side dish making gloves, but I throw them out after and I feel like it's such a waste. I think I need to get me some like rubber gloves or something. I should, but does that mean I will? Does that mean I would? Does that mean I could? I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying now. Thank you for watching this video. <laughs> Make sure you grab your merch. 
You can also choose to sponsor or become a VIP member of this channel with the link down below. I also post daily stories and some photos here and there on my Instagram. So I'll check you out on there and these other platforms as well. We also post two to three times a week on our family channel linked right here. So don't miss the fun stories, the vlogs, the challenges on here as well. And I'll see you next time. Bye!